Okay guys, I'm back with the second part of this video because I, I got cut off as usual. So back to this little corner here in the dining room that I've decorated. Um, again, uh, talking about this painting, I really love this painting. It has a special meaning to me. And so I do plan on probably keeping it. Um, we'll just have to wait and see if I ever decide to sell it or not. But yeah, and um, I thought it just looked really pretty here in this corner. Down here is my old rocking chair. My aunt actually gave me this chair and it came as it is, except that I put the shawl in the back of it and because the paint is pretty much scratched up and just, you know, added that little pillow there and everything. But it's really cute and I do plan on doing some vids while sitting here in the dining room so that I'll have a, you know, a nicer background than it, than it had when I was in the studio. Um, so, yeah. And then over here, I moved my windows that I had in the center of the larger um, wall by the table. And I just added a, a sheer curtain of lace and added the windows. And here I think you can see better the, two, the double moons of Dune that I had painted on a piece of canvas that I bought from Walmart. And I simply painted it, cut it out, the shape of the window, stapled it to the back after I painted it. Um, and of course the windows are two windows that my son had gone for me and I simply ended up um, gluing them and fastening them together so they would be one, one like one window. And then I just added the, you know, the faux foliage to it to just give it some life. And I think that the light makes it really pop better here than it did in the other wall. So I like it. And then down here, I just have a simple little arrangement on this little wooden table here. I have my incense, or should I say my wax melt burner, which smells divine. My candlesticks, uh, a little flower arrangement of roses, um, a little flask with the glasses, and a little Buddha. And of course, I do believe in all sorts of good luck charms and what have you. Um, being as to what I'm into. So, you know, anything that has a good vibe is good for me, you know? So that's basically what this corner looks like. It's very simple. There's nothing major to it. Up here is my floral chandelier. I decided to make it gypsy-ish, very romantic, as if you're like in a, in a countryside somewhere and you're doing it kind of country. Um, I just added a whole bunch of faux flowers to the top of it, and I think it looks really beautiful. I had them cascading down a little bit. And this uh, chandelier was my son's, but it's now mine. I'm just using it here in the dining room to give it some soft lighting. So I don't have to use the major, you know, light. I really like romantic, you know, the romantic lighting. So, yeah. So isn't that pretty? I think it looks really beautiful with the hydrangeas, the roses, and the cascading lilacs. So let me know what you guys think. And going back this way, of course, I'm going to scan the curtains and the tablescape again. So let me know, guys, what y'all thought of this idea. And it will probably definitely change because I like to change things up for whatever occasion. But this will probably stay here for a bit. And I really do like the way the table looks. I love that ruffle in the middle of the front of the table. So yep, there it goes. So until next time guys, let me know what you think of it on comments. And love to everybody. Muchos besos. Until next time, this is Brenda from Braceways. Bye-bye.